North Dakota State had five players named to the Sets Perform FCS preseason All-America team. NDSU sophomore quarterback Trey Lance and senior left tackle Dylan Radins were named to the first team. Northern Iowa led the Missouri Valley Football Conference with six selections. In all, 17 Valley athletes were honored on this year's team. The Fargo Force have rounded out the coaching staff with an assistant coach, RJ Giz Gisevich joins the staff from the college ranks. I'll learn that one in time, I think. The Fargo Force report mid-month for fall training camp with preseason games currently scheduled for October with the regular season set to open November 6th. The Red Hawks have pushed the win streak to eight. And well, that is great. I hear nine is just fine. I'm sorry, I had to. Bottom of the first, the Red Hawks facing a former Hawk himself, Tyler Heron, on the mound for the for Sioux Falls. Brennan Metzger on first from a leadoff single. Grell Prime lifts the ball and dumps it into right center. As Metzger rounds second, the right fielder misses the ball. And while Metzger is heading home on the air, slides in for the one nothing Red Hawks lead to open things up. Canaries answer right back in the top of the second, though. Roy Morales puts a single through and out to right field to score the equalizer, and that's where things are all the way into the top of the ninth. Two on, two outs for Sioux Falls, and a storm is brewing. Brett Helton on the mound for the Hawks. Mike Hart breaks his bat on the single to third. Fielder's choice for out number three. But the Hawks aren't up just yet. Yeah, that storm was brewing. I meant literally. They head in to the rain delay. Back in action now. They remain tied 1-1 in the 10th inning. The Minnesota Twins snapped a six-game losing streak Tuesday night in a come-from-behind win. They looked at Jose Barrios in tonight's rubber match. Great start for the Twins. Open up a three-run lead in the second. All started with a solo Jake Cave home run. Barrios gives up just a single run in his six innings as the Twins give him plenty of run support here. They currently hold an 8-1 lead in the eighth inning. That's